I want to be better every day. Go outside? Let's go outside. <laughs> Let's go outside, buddy. Sit. I think everybody has someone that they look up to. Like for me, I have friends that are super good at being friends. They're really hospitable. They ask questions about mine and Abigail and Lenny's life. Like they wanna get to know us and I wanna be like that, you know? I wanna be the type of person that's a good friend. I have a mentor who was a professor in college who was so wise. He would walk into a room and the room would just wait and wait and wait to finally hear what this professor would have to say. Because we wanted to know what he thought, we wanted to know what he was feeling, we wanted to know him, and I wanted to be like that, I still do, right? I wanna be able to have knowledge, to have wisdom, in order to share it with others. I have other friends who are just so musically talented, like they, they walk up to a piano or a, a guitar and they just start playing these beautiful melodies, they start playing and singing and it just sounds so good and I want to be like that. I want to just be able to sit down, strum a tune, and it just to sound so good. By 25, I just assumed that I would be a combination of all of those things. Like I would just have it. I would be good at music and I'd be wise and all those certain things and it just never happened. Well, that's not entirely true. I just didn't really work for it. All these people are wise, smart, musically talented, great friends, and they work for it, right? They set up their lives in order to look like that day by day by day. So that's what I wanna do. I wanna be better every day. I wanna set up my life to where I'm always trying to get better every single day. So here's my plan. In the month of June, I wanna get better in four ways. Mentally, physically, Financially and hobbyly. I think that's the word. Mentally. In the month of June, I want to read these three books. I've been working on them a little bit for the last three months or so. I just want to finish them physically. Ready to work out? So we just sit down. We're also going to try. <laughs> Lenny, don't ruin a shot. I've never worked out pretty regularly before. I've um, just gotten in spurts of like going to the gym with a friend. Uh, I think I've done that twice for like two weeks at a time, but never for an extended amount of like <laughs> 21 days or like a month or whatever it takes to get the habit set. But Abigail has been working out pretty regularly for the last like ever. Uh, only when I'm with friends. Abigail's been working this one workout for the last month and she's begged me to join it. And so now that we're doing this whole better every day thing, I'm gonna actually join it. I'm very excited. I don't have to do it alone anymore. But in January, our friends Tyler and Sarah started doing 50, no, 100 push ups every day, 50 crunches, and 10 minutes of cardio. So we're gonna do that and add in. 50 squats too. I hate this. One thing that I like about it is that it's not a lot, but it's still enough to see results, but it's small enough to where we feel like we can actually do it every day. Do you think we'll actually see, like, will we see results on? I saw results on. <laughs> I did see results, but it's also only like 15 minutes. Yeah, it's not that bad. So it's like, I can do that really fast. Mm -hmm. Q workout montage. <laughs> Financially. So we're talking about budget first. Do you have anything to do, No. <laughs> budget talk on the porch. Can I see it from the other side? <laughs> yeah. I want this side. Actually. Let's talk budget. Have we been good at budgeting? No. <laughs> In the past. In the past. We've actually never 
budgeted it before. Have we? Many one since I. We have made budgets in the past, mm -hmm. but we have not known where every dollar is going. Which is like the main point <laughs> of a budget. We have loosely kept a budget. Yeah, so we know like the We're ballpark. We're not irresponsible. Yeah, well maybe a little bit. When we've saved for things. What's one thing that we've saved for? A phone. A vacation. Other things. But now, because we want to get better at a lot of different things, we want to get better financially. And so one of the ways that you get better financially is you actually have a budget and you stick with the budget no matter if you're already out of fast food money and it's Wednesday. <laughs> and you start it on Monday. And you start on Monday. We have to give credit to our friends who gave us their budget template and we just put our numbers in, yep. so our monthly income, and then divided it up. So thank you to Shelby and Prudence Martin, Chris and Jenny Harness for sharing their budgets with us. Thank you so much. They were really helpful. For the first time in our lives, we've got a budget where every dollar that we bring in actually goes somewhere and we know where it's going. And so the plan is to get better financially. We'll know where each dollar goes. And by the end of the month, we'll see if we actually stuck to it. If we have every box filled with the exact money or if we failed. Wish us luck. And then hobbly. Spike ball. So we've been playing almost every day for the last two months or so. And we're seeing a lot of improvement, but I just want to continue to get better. And if it's possible, play in a tournament in Nashville in July. So that's how I and we are going to get better every day. I would love for you to answer the question, how are you going to get better in the month of June? Let me know in the comments below. Please like and subscribe and check back later this month to see if we're good financially, or I guess better financially, better mentally, better physically, and better hobby-wise. Yeah. Better at our hobbies. Cool thing. <laughs> Thanks for watching.